when you do YouTube, do YouTube because you love to make certain kinds of content, not because of the views, not because of the money. Do it because you love to do it. No other reason. Hey guys, what's up? I'm Third Times the Charm. You can't see it. But it's getting again. Bringing you guys everything gaming. I don't know about you guys, but I've enjoyed some of the games that have been on the Xbox uh, Games for Gold list, whether it's on the 360 or the Xbox One. I think the program's uh, a great program to get people to try to play the console, experience what the consoles can do, different games that they can offer. But there's a game coming out on Games for Gold in April that I think has got to be one of the best Games for Gold to ever come out, in my opinion. Sunset Overdrive. Headlines, Xbox's April 2016 Free Games with Gold. Officially, April 2016's Free Games with Gold will include Dead Space uh, and Saints Row 4 on the 360. Both are great games. I've played Dead Space. Uh, and I've played a little bit of Saints Row 4. Both of them are in f uh, fun, awesome games. I encourage you guys to pick those games up when they do come out on Games for Gold on the 360. As well as Sunset Overdrive and The Wolf Among Us on Xbox One. I haven't played either or, but uh, I've seen a lot of Sunset Overdrive. It looks like a lot of fun. I've heard almost nothing but good things about it. People say mainly it's just a lot of fun. And now The Wolf Among Us, it's really not my kind of game from what it looks like. I've seen people play it. But if it's free, I may just go ahead and check it out. It doesn't seem terrible. I think it may just take some time to get used to it. Xbox Live Gold subscribers will be getting their money's worth next month. As usual, next month will bring four new free games for subscribers to download. Two on the 360 and two on the one. First of all, Xbox One owners can download all five episodes of Telltale's The Wolf Among Us from the April 1st from, to April 30th. Now, The Wolf Among Us, if you're not familiar with it, is a video game prequel to Fables, a popular comic book series. But gamers don't have to be familiar whatsoever with the books to enjoy the game. I like that. I like that you don't have to read. You know, if anything, comics or books should just add on to what already is in the game. Uh, more details and things like that. So I really like that. I think that'll help maybe attract others to play it. That way they're not missing much. Then from April 15th to May 15th, gamers will have the chance to download one of the Xbox One's most critically acclaimed exclusive games, Sunset Overdrive. Now, Sunset Overdrive is developed by Insomniac Games. It's an open world game, which I love open world games. I've always loved open world games. Probably one of my favorite kind of games, other than like third person shooters or things like that. Wherein players are encouraged to never stop moving through the city as they do battle with the game's vicious mutants. Just a reminder guys, thanks to the latest Xbox One update, Xbox One owners can download both Dead Space and Saints Row 4 much more conveniently. This is because my this is because Microsoft has now made it possible to purchase Xbox 360 games directly on the Xbox One itself, meaning players don't have to drag out their old 360 systems to take advantage of the new free games. Thank God, because that's what I've had to do. I think I've missed some awesome free Xbox 360 games because I just don't feel like hooking it up anymore. I know it seems really lazy, but I've got my P my my PC, my one, my monitors set up, and I don't want to, you know, I, I use it to test games I used to find diving, but it's on my shelf. I don't feel like dragging out the controller, dragging out the cords, oh, you know, finding a place to plug it in. I just, I like that they made it more convenient. So it's a lazy proof method. <laughs> And I think that's really nice and awesome that they did that. So that's really good for them. Xbox Live Gold subscribers can still check out March 2016's Free Games with Gold until April 1st. Headlining last month's offerings were the likes of Sherlock Holmes Crimes and Punishment, which I have downloaded. I still have to play it. I heard it's an okay game. It's more of like a, a point, point and click. You can do point and click or you can move around. Kind of like L.A. Noir. So if you liked L.A. Noir, I think you'll find some enjoyment of Sherlock Holmes Crimes and Punishment. There's also going to be the original Borderlands game on the 360. And so you can download this through your one to make it more convenient. I tried playing the first Borderlands way back when. I got stuck, so I stopped playing it. I got stuck somewhere on a boss fight. But I did start playing two, but then I, I picked it mainly up on the one, and I've, I've loved playing Borderlands 2. Um, so I highly encourage you guys to pick up those games, play those games. I think both of those are decent uh, as well. And yeah, let me know if you guys have had any enjoyment or you know disappointment out of any of these games listed. Um, Sunset Overdrive. Make sure you guys check it out. Heard it's a lot of fun. I probably will too. Until next time, guys. I'm Third Times the Jarm. You can't see it. But it's getting can. Bring you guys everything gaming. Meow, meow.